Well, first of all, how satisfied are you with that victory today? Yeah, um, it was important. We got off to a winning start. Obviously, we've not, we've been stuttering at home, and I'm delighted we've got another clean sheet. Um, been talking about that, keeping clean sheets, and we'll win a lot of football games. And I thought we looked solid again today. Uh, Wes pulled off a great save after giving them a corner away, but I think he was a little little bit bored and wanted wanted a save. But no, he made a good save, and um, we looked solid and. We created a few chances today, which we've managed to put two of them away. Well, on that, that's three in a week now, clean sheets, isn't it? I mean, is that in down, what do you believe that's down to? Switching back to a back three or, or mentality or, or both? What? Uh, good habits. Um, yeah, obviously, I think that we are more comfortable in that formation. Um, we've played it a lot, uh, for a lot of years, but um, you've still got to defend properly whether you're playing, you know, Two centre halves or three centre halves, and I think at the minute we've we've um, we've looked solid, like I've said, and it's only going to breed confidence and good habits all over the pitch. And uh, like I say, I'm delighted it gives us a platform, and then we can go and put the ball in in the back of the net at the other end. Is that something? Because obviously Slavisa Kanovic did that in his last two matches, but is that something you, as a group of players, said to him? Look, we would prefer to play this way; it suits us. Yeah, I think he. Um, I think we tried it, you know, we tried it under him a few times and we didn't quite look um, as usual self. Um, whether we should have stuck at it or not, you know, we we'll, won't know, but we tried other formations. But even whatever formation we play, we um, we haven't been good enough up to now this season. So hopefully this last week um, is the start of a push for us because we're more than capable of climbing the ladder. And uh, hopefully we've done that a few places today and got to keep driving each other on, which... Every single day it counts, which I think um, I spoke about it to the other manager about our standards in training have, have not been as good as what they should be, and it leads on to a game on, on, a, on a weekend or on a midweek game. So we've got to be at each other every single day, so then it becomes easier on a, on a Saturday afternoon. Um, but today's only going to be great for the lads' confidence, clean sheet, three points, and a couple of goals. Obviously, Rian's got on the score sheet as well. Come on to that in a second. Such as what? What do you think? as captain then wasn't happening nearly enough to get you where you want to be for a match day? Individual standards, day in, day out. Um, obviously, manager two, two managers ago always used to drive on about it. Standards in training, um, if someone's not doing it, make sure they're pulling the weight. And um, I think we, we're starting to slowly, but hopefully we can get there a little bit quicker than it's taken up to now this season um, to get our standards back where they should be and where we, where we want to be so it's a good win clean sheet and uh, another game coming up uh, next weekend because just to the kind of naked air I suppose today you seem the whole group seemed right at it from the off today I mean crosses were going into the box with great regularity early on there was there was evidence that that intensity of play is coming back would, would you agree yeah you know I don't want to talk about the old, old manager too much but he, he wanted intensity as well just in in a, in a different way and um, we've gone about things really well today. I think people did drive each other on, which that's what it's about out there. That's what we are, we're teammates. Whether one of the lads ain't doing too well, you've got to, you've got to pick him up and go again and turn it around. And um, there were some good performances out there today and um, I'm, I'm happy that we've, we've got three points and like I keep saying, a clean sheet. It's only good for the, the boys at the back and it gives us a platform to go and get the goals to win the game. Because of everything, there's always going to be a big focus on Rian Brewster. I'm sure he's used to that by now. So his recent form, his personal recent form with the goal at Blackburn and then today, what's that done for him? Well, yeah, hopefully it gives him some confidence. Um, he's going to get opportunities out there. I knew when I come on, I knew there was going to be uh, an opportunity and I had a couple of chances which I've managed to put one away, but it was a good turn and a good finish. He's got that in the locker. I've said it before, he's got hell of a finisher, he just needs to believe he can do it week in, week out and once you get on a goal goal streak, it's uh, it's a good feeling, so hopefully he can keep doing it and I'll keep pushing him from behind. Well, I was going to say, it's kind of difficult to have this conversation with you about wanting him to play more when you want to play quite a lot yourself in that role up front with, as it looks at the moment, McGoldrick and, and Gibbs White flanking either side of you. Yeah, obviously we won the last game, so... To be honest, I wasn't really expecting many changes. Um, I just have to be ready to, when I come on and play my part and obviously help the team out, which I, th I thought did did well when I come on. So hopefully I've given the manager an headache for the next game. 
Six goals now. Six assists, I think, as well in the process. You must be delighted by it to have things together. Yeah, I'd rather have 12 goals, but no. Um, no, as long as I've said it. Uh, yes, you said that before. <laughs> a few a few <laughs> weeks ago, I said, look, as long as I'm I'm performing out there and still helping the team out, I'll, I'll be happy. And obviously, today was a great ball from Didzy. Um, I had to get something on it, and I managed to do that, um, which there's no better feeling. I've said it many times. Uh, three yards out of the cop end, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a great feeling. So hopefully there's many more to come.